yhteisö Suomessa ja sieltä tulee pitämään puheet Juha, Juha Veronen, Veronen ja Erika Patrikainen. Welcome! Welcome! Hyvää iltaa! Uh, and for the international quest, uh, good evening. First, I want to tell a little story. About 20 years ago, there was a group of ch guys just playing volleyball in the park across the railway, very near. And they have heard or read somewhere. Uh, as you see, on that time there was no internet. That in Amsterdam there will be a gay Olympics. So they decided to go there, and of course they needed a sports club. And that's the short story how the sports club Hotel City was born. Your host, also your. Amazingly, some of those guys are still going to play volleyball tomorrow in Nagelagrinne and uh, probably me too. Nowadays, HOT is a vital club with 250 members and more than 10 sports. We offer regular activities in the capital city area as well as in Tampere. HOT is the unfortunately only Finnish LGBTIQ sports club at the moment, but we are looking much more to come after these games. Yeah, during the preparations, we've been asked many times why do we still need separate games for gender and sexual minorities? Well, it's not given yet that each and everyone can do their sports out of the closet, in their team or in a club or in their country. So it varies a lot how people take it. So that's why we still need the LGBTIQ sports idols and these games. And these games also provide a safe and very friendly at atmosphere for everyone to do their sports. <laughs> yes, your games is about sports, but it's also about human rights, and it's about friends, and it's about love. <laughs> and organizing these games has been an enormous task for us, but we're here because of our volunteers. We have an excellent crew and hundreds of volunteers who are working here tonight also. We want to thank them and we also want to thank the city and the mayor and all all our uh, partners who've been with us and made this possible. As a mark of respect for the victims of Orlando. We would like to remember them with the one minute silence, please. Järjestön ihmiset. Welcome, Anette Wachter and Paul Brummett. Welcome. Good evening, Europe. The board of the European Gay and Lesbian Sport Federation really appreciates that you have come from all over Europe and beyond 
to be part of this unique event which reminds us all of how important our work is. Work for inclusion, acceptance and diversity in sport. But in particular, discrimination because of sexual orientation, characteristics or gender identity and expression. You are all accepted without question here, but that is unfortunately not the case everywhere else. But things get better. Things get better thanks to you and thanks to our host here this week, the Sports Club Hot Helsinki. And of course, all the volunteers and officials. Without your amazing hard work, especially in the face of the difficulties in the past year, we would not be here today. We are also want to thank the city of Helsinki, all the other partners and the patron of the event, the president of Finland, Sauli Ninistu. Prepare yourselves to be challenged, excited and inspired. We would like to wish you all a competitive and fair games and we wish each and every one of you the very best of luck and that you meet up with friends and make new ones throughout the week. We would now like to invite the Mayor of Helsinki, Mr. Jussi Pajunen, onto the stage. Jussi Pajunen! We would like to honour you with this token of our deepest appreciation for your outstanding contribution to our community. Esteemed co-presidents of EGLSF, welcome Eurogames Helsinki 2016. Welcome to Helsinki. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you are co all cordially welcome to Helsinki and to the official opening of the Eurogames here in Helsinki 2016. We are extremely happy and proud to host this championship event. We are especially delighted that you are celebrating the opening ceremony, ceremony together with all the people of Helsinki, residents and visitors alike. You have chosen the optimal moment for the event. Helsinki is one of the Europe's fastest growing and developing cities. It is also an increasingly international city, where new attractive districts are being built in the inner city right next to the waterfront of the Baltic Sea. At the same time, the city is cultivating a new type of invaluable resource. By this, I mean a new kind of urban community life which stems from active and aware citizens and turns our city into an even better place to live, to visit and to work. What is it then that makes a great and livable city? Festivals and events play a fundamental role as well as a rich and varied cultural life. Events are a great way to bring people together and Eurogames 2016 is a fantastic example of such an activity. We are very proud to have the 
Eurogames 2016 here in the middle of Helsinki Pride Week, uh, which the highlight and uh, the highlight of the Helsinki Pride Week is on Saturday with the Pride Parade. Smooth public services, good infrastructure and reliable administration are also important cornerstones. A prerequisite for these qualities, in turn, is openness. Helsinki has set at, as its aim to be a world leader in this field. From the city government's point of view, openness means a transparent administration and user-oriented services. In a wider context, openness is something much stronger and even revolutionary. In my view, openness is all, all about creating a better city, where the citizens genuinely participate in the development and decision-making. An open city is also welcoming new ideas and outside influence. Most importantly, an open society is respectful to people with different backgrounds and strives to harness diversity as a richness. In today's world, this becomes more and more important. Recent events have demonstrated many sad and alarming developments both in Europe and further away. We face a tremendous challenge of safeguarding the fundamental values of our societal model and human rights while fighting prejudice, discrimination and extremism. Dear friends, the whole question boils down to one essential element. Us, the people. The more we meet and interact, the more we understand each other and base our thinking on. The Eurogames 2016 reflects many important idols of our society, such as fighting against discrimination and promotion of e equality regardless of gender identity or sexual orientation. We are proud to host the Eurogames in Helsinki. Special thanks to HOT Association, which has promoted and encouraged equal opportunities in sports during two decades already. I wish all the competitors every success in the coming days. Have an enjoyable stay in Helsinki. With these words, I declare the Eurogames 2016, the Eurogames 2016 open. Welcome to Helsinki. Have a good competition. Thank you. Thank you. That was your seat by the men.